You know, I figured it would be uh, poetic to start our hardest mission yet with a, the bench press, basically. Hi right, everyone, welcome back to XCOM. Uh, we're gonna go to a landed UFO, large UFO that is. Um, kind of, uh, yeah, um, not gonna be easy. I'll tell you some of the things I'm planning here with this loadout here. Um, Pat one is, as far as I'm concerned, now expendable. Um, I'm gonna, like, literally, when things get hard, I'm gonna put him into the middle of groups of enemies and that's it. Um, and hope he takes a couple of shots. Um, he is the expendable one for this mission. I'm sorry, Pat. But honestly, we're really short on resources, so we really need th to capture this entire thing alive. Um, Darwell naturally is our gunner. Um, I gave him a laser sight just simply because I don't know what, what else the fuck to give him. Uh, there's nothing else here that really benefits him, I think, in my opinion. Uh, our infantry is coming along. Uh, he can reload whenever he wants. I gave him a flashbang in that. Also, we have the HE grenades to blow up cover uh, if the opportunity arises. Even Darwell will do it. Um, we also have uh, our sniper. Sniper now has the new laser sniper rifle, so that should really come in handy for this mission. And we have a rocketeer and another rocketeer. Because um, when shit goes really south and I really need to remove someone, we, uh, as in total in this entire squad, we have, between these two people, um, fucking two shredder rockets and four regular rockets. So, as I said, when shit goes down, uh, fucking, we're gonna, we're gonna just take it out. Because I have a feeling that, you know, shit is gonna go south a lot in this mission. Um, and we really need it to go right. Um, I know there's no medics, and Halodin's here with a regular shotgun, I know, because I'm planning on using him f for shotgun flanks. It's all he's gonna be here for. Um, that's that's all I can really do at this point. Uh, so let's we really need this. So, um, I think with laser weapons we'll be okay, but it, I think they still get more difficult. We'll be deploying to Russia for this one. Russia. Reports indicate the UFO set down in a sparsely populated area. We need to stay sharp and eliminate the invaders. All right, Sky Ranger, land us here as the trees pop in. I don't know. There's the large UFO out in the distance. HQ, this is Big Sky. We are in position and awaiting further orders. Roger that, Big Sky. Strike one. You are green to deploy. Approach with extreme caution. Current enemy status at the site is unknown. Here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking we just go into the fucking trees here, and uh, fuck everything else. Let's let's go go like goad some of them to come back and fight us in the trees, where, where we have nice full cover and shit. So I'm up for that. I don't care about the rest of you, because that's what we're doing. Uh, all right, we got some more full cover let's here. The other rocketeer will On eventually come over there. Where's the gunner? Gunner will definitely take. Uh, that cover over there. So I think that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna activate everything with the shiv and run the fuck back. Uh, and that's like be just because I started back in this area, this is what we're doing. So I'm just gonna get a couple of them to come over. Because everything is. Yeah, okay, so there's definitely Muton on this map somewhere. I don't know what that is. I guess we'll find out real soon. Never come up there. There you go. That's the that's the spirit. Uh, shotgunner will probably just take beh cover behind that. Um, I'm still good with keeping my rocketeers behind this cover here. What's this? Where's this infantry gonna go? Maybe the infantry should go in the. Run over here? Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Oh no, that's a rocketeer. Shit. Whatever. We'll just move him up in a second. Uh, the, the shivs are adorable because he can move up the uh, down the cliffs there. Alright. Uh, yeah, they're inside the UFO there. We should be good though if we just open them up and then run back out with the shiv. Alright. 
Where are you, Shivy? Shivmeister. This looks to be a supply ship of some kind, and the potential storage capacity is enormous. If the aliens are really attempting to bring in this much outside material, it can only mean they're ramping up the scale of the invasion. Hey, you think? I want, to, I want him to go over here, because I, I want my two Rocketeers kind of together here. Even though I think they all get grenades now. Headed there now. Got it covered. you. I love that advanced fire control. Oh, here we go. We have some floaters. It begins. Are these regular floaters, or...? I don't think it starts off that soon. Holy shit, a group of five. Alright, one overwatched over there. A couple over there. Alright. I think that's one... I, I think that's a heavy floater right there. Nope, that's a normal floater. This has a buttload of stuff. Alright. Precision shot is... A go. What other shots do we have here? Just him. We can definitely just suppress that guy. I'm gonna see if I can take a shot with him. Because I can potentially get just get someone in the back. The thing I don't really like here is that Um these two don't can't shoot anything. Uh I I don't think that's odd. That's actually probably granted at a like all things. I think we, we continue to get suppression, even though we don't see him. I'm worried about having him all the way up here, though. 58. Not a very good chance to hit. Could do uh, rapid fire. I think we might be actually moving this fellow back. Because I'm just so worried. Alright, Sniper needs to take a shot. Yeah, you're gonna take a shot on the that one there with a crit because I need him dead. We also have this new laser rifle. That's really nice. Uh, watch, and we're gonna just bring this guy right behind here. And now we can't see them. We were not. This is a good thing. So this means they have to kind of move up on us. Uh, we also hear a muton, so we're, we're gonna be very careful not to activate anything we don't want to activate. So until until we get rid of those guys, we're officially not fucking going back there. Alright. Just overwatch all the way. They'll they'll eventually come after us, don't worry don't worry about it. They might come through like the a door or something, or over there. There's just way too many scary, spooky noises right now to, to move up anywhere. Especially the fact we do not bring any med kits, really. Uh, we just have one, and that's to stabilize. I'll be honest. This is gonna be one of those hour-long missions again. I guarantee you that. Shut up. Listen. Alright, here we go. I'm also not planning on walking into their overwatch. I'm planning on them walking into mine. Alright. Their first shot of the day. We have uh, some hollow targeting with him, so he will take the opening shot. It's a mess. Damn it, missed the target. Uh, we could do another precision shot with this guy. My, my one concern is that I may not be able to kill him in one hit, but... Okay, that, we're gonna use a precision shot. The sniper, I have a feeling, is gonna be one of the most useful things on this mission for me. You might as well reload it. Overwatch. They'll be back, trust me. We saw like five floaters in total, we've only killed one. Uh, let's get a reload with the sniper, just because I'm a little bit worried. And reload the Gatling gun too, in case I need to do some a lot of suppressions. You guys know where I am. Oh, actually, maybe they don't. And the game just froze for a sec. All right. It's not your video. It's uh, my my computer. <laughs> the Shiv smells the melt. I'm sorry, Shiv. You're gonna have to. We're not, Meld is not a priority. Alright, we'll just be over here. 
Uh, I see, uh, oh no, that's, that's not, that's not floaters. See, what I'm really worried about is, like, I don't know, they're not coming for me, so. We're going to scooch forward just a little bit. Alright. I decide, uh, I d I'm deciding to reload with the shiv. Are they coming through there? What are they doing? I know they're roaming around. I might just bust open that door and just come through it, but... I don't know. If I do that, I'm risking opening up something I really don't want to. Oh, there we go. Okay. Let's open up with the uh, this guy over here. Or did I say open? I mean close it up. Remember, Shiv is expendable. That's why he's in the front. There we go. Shiv isn't as reliable as it used to be. It used to do really well at the beginning of missions here. All right. Yeah, I should get shot up a bit. Oh, here we go, we got another one. Ah, oh, nice! He's down. Falling back. So we got, I think this is the last one. Um, because we took out two already. And there's like two more, alright. The wall is apparently hungry. Roger. I've got my We're gonna just give it another on. turn. Roger. I've got my eyes. Probably should reload my, uh, Halo in here. Yeah, okay, let's do some reloads. Alright, so the plan is to basically activate them, run back. Oh no, here we go. It's not carrying a weapon like the others. What could it be doing? What alien? Which one are you referring to? Oh, what the fuck? This already? Oh my fucking Jesus. <laughs> uh, hi guys, I want to introduce you to Muton uh, uh, Elites Berserkers. Hey, remember that rocket launcher we had? Oh my fucking god. Um, alright. Oh my fucking my fuck. Way. All right, you're gonna shoot that. I, I really hope if you deviate away, it's gonna be slightly more away from my guys here. Cause I cannot move him this turn. Oh good, the shredder rocket did that, all right. So they're intimidating. All right. All right, you do not have a shot on anybody. Well, sniper's gonna have to take a shot. What the fuck, are you serious? Alright, I use a shredder rocket for this purpose, but... I am right now debating... My, okay, I gotta, I gotta save this guy. No crits, really? Look how much fucking health they have. So basically, they can they can make my soldiers panic, but he didn't panic. Okay. Now, because of the fact that they're so together like this, we actually just might rocket them. Or, um, let's see, the gunner has a shot here too. Yeah, gunner. Come the fuck on, we really need this. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, no crits, like, at all. You don't see anything. Oh look, okay, we can get a crit with this guy. Okay, 
Thank goodness. I kind of needed that, so that's kind of nice. All right. So how, do, how does this work? Is he in cover or no? So we, we had a crit on the other guy. I want to save my overwatch potentially for him. Um, I, I What I really need here is two crits. But however, I don't want to really move up anybody. Yeah, let's do this here. Really? Really? Oh boy. A oh, close combat specialist. Oh, fuck, you missed it. Of all fucking things. <laughs> I needed that. Alright, I know they're gonna take reaction fire. Shift doesn't care. Oh, you can't see anybody. Wonderful. Alright, we got one more shot here and potentially one more something. We can potentially get him. Just hoping he kind of moves out up against him. Yeah, he's gonna panic. I don't care. What matters is we get rid of these guys right now. Come on, do the five damage, do the five damage. Yes, even a crit. Oh my god, we got rid of them. We don't care. It's still, it worked out really well in our favor here. Thank you, Shiv, you did something. <laughs> All right, we just took on Muton Elites with laser weapons, which is not the worst thing in the world. Oh, yeah, go. Oh, wait, no. Okay, it was just, uh, he missed. It's okay. Is that it? I hope, I hope, I hope that's it. Alright, these two are panicked, so we need to take, um... Apparently no shots. I need, I need to get sight on them for my sniper to do something, so we're moving up. Sniper cannot shoot. Oddly enough. Fucking hell. This is really random. Alright, who do we have the best shot on? We're gonna take a shot on the guy in the back here. Alright. I kinda need this guy to live, so... That worked. Alright, let's move the shiv up to here, just so he can just distract somebody with a... Uh, uh, actually, we're just overwatch. Um, the, the sniper is... No, the sniper will not overwatch. Okay, never mind then. Well, that, that, he's doing a double move anyway, so we're good. Uh, he can't... He's not gonna kill my assault. I mean, you know, he took, got a bit of health taken away... And all he did, like, he, he killed a muton out of it. Okay, there's definitely somebody up here. Alright. Uh, this person's gonna have to reload. I mean, I used the Shredder Rocket so they'd take more damage in the beginning. I, I don't regret that decision at all. I think it was probably one of the better things I could have done with her. Reloaded. On the watch. Uh, alright. You just move back here. How much is he missing? Yeah, just four health. That's uh, a good deal. Alright, we still have some more Mutons on the map. Uh, very unfortunately, but that's okay. Uh, let's go over here and reload. Ready to engage. 
Now, the, the new weapon that I have uh, for the laser rifle has actually less ammunition than normal. Uh, you guys are spoiled by the extreme amounts of ammunition we usually have with it. We know where they are definitely now. But the plan is to not move anybody until we're absolutely into position. of some kind. As repugnant as the thought may be, this is most likely how they keep their latest test subjects alive. Well, we do see a floater. He's not active, though. Um, he doesn't even notice us, so... Is he alive? Like, like where's his group? Was this one of the ones that maybe I saw earlier and then didn't kill? I'm kind of worried. Uh... I don't think I do, can do... Uh, let's just suppress him. Okay, I, I guess he is just like, just here. Alright. Shotgunner's gonna move up here. I think one of my rocketeers can now go there. Just kind of spread them out a bit further. <laughs> I, see, I see the bullets coming out. I, I'm, I'm just curious on what the what he's doing. So, yeah, he's he's there, but like he got a miss because obviously we're we're there. I, I, we must have activated him before, but now it's just an easy flank. So let's just kill him. I, I guess we missed one, and he was just floating around the map. Weirdly enough, I didn't get a full crit on him, but uh, whatever. Alright, well let's go back to trying to figure out where they are. Alright, can, who can hear him? That's the main thing. I'm just debating where they are, because then that, depend that will reflect if I'm going to fast forward or not. So as you can see, I kind of position myself a little bit differently now. Alright, okay, they're probably near the cockpit, so yeah, it's time to, time to go forward. We got uh, some stealth modes. All right, and we have uh, that guy, this asshole right here. 
There we go. Look at, look at this fucking Jesus shot. <laughs> Love this shit. Five damage, damn it. Like, fucking, you didn't have that much of a chance to miss that. Fucking bullshit. What the hell? We, 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 okay, we literally were so far, we could not hear him get shot until over there. Anyways, uh, we're pulling back because nobody else can get shot. Uh, Rocketeer, go right here. Yeah, I kind of, I did speed, I did start to speed it up, and then we didn't actually need the speed up, and it just occurred to me, like, aye, aye, let's just take a shot over here then. Uh, the shotgunner can come back here. Uh, I don't like this guy's positioning. But, okay, by the way, this guy has Sentinel, by the way. I should mention. So he gets two fucking uh, reaction shots as well with his like opportunist bonus. So he's like a crazy overwatch and we haven't uh, we haven't actually seen him utilize any of it. Which I find to be really odd. Uh, my, by the way, my sniper is not that far back. Uh, so my sniper will be fine. The sniper is literally just in the trees kind of like over... Well, I think you, you saw me take a shot, didn't you? So... Like right here. This is this is close enough that we can we can help her out. She's at the very least in range. Alright. He's gonna continue spotting for my people. The thing I find most surprising is the Seeker's AI. How they refuse to flank you, crit you, basically. They they when they use their cloak. They always use it basically to um, to try and strangle you, uh, which I find kind of odd. Although they might decloak and try and get my shiv. That's actually what I'm kind of counting on. But he's overwatching, so it's okay. So it, the AI is just kind of moving in its spare time here. So from here, we can basically we're we're now good to basically see things. We could also run and gun my uh, assault somewhere if needed. Ah, uh, here's one. Oh my god! He got shrekt. Ah, that's two. I don't think I don't think we have another one. Ah, oh, here we go. Oh my god, you're fucking double overwatch, man. He did he did fire one. Alright, well that one I don't think we could do a whole lot about. Yeah. That poor assault, man. I feel kind of bad for him. The roll will take care of you. Don't worry. They all fucking they all fucking got rid of uh, all the people at once. Surprised another one after the sniper, to be honest. Also that I could have reloaded my uh my other person there. So we still have somewhere, um... Uh... What's, a, what's his name? We have that thin man we didn't kill. We came close to it. So we may have to move up back to the front there to basically see him. Oh, he's kind of down here now. Potentially we're gonna be going into his overwatch fire, but that's okay. Well, he ain't there. As soon as I get rid of that guy, we can actually make a headway for the uh, uh, the cockpit. And yes, we know there's a mutant somewhere on the map. Oh. Okay. Oh, that, no, that'd be the Thin Man. He is unfortunately being a fucking douche, and he's just... He just opened up, uh, the door there. Alright, we're gonna run away from him. I'm pretty sure that he can get to us, like, from down there, so I'm gonna just move my shift just again. 
no point in moving up yet. Yeah, because he opened the door, we now have to approach the cockpit from the other side. Uh, there's, there's no question about that. Alright, let's hope he, uh, he opens a, a routine. Oh no, he didn't open a route for us. Because we don't actually know what's in here, and I'm just going to assume it's death. So we're going to go through that way. Uh, there is platforms for us to go up there, so... That sounds kind of like Outsiders. Okay, Shiv's getting shut up now. And I can't see him. Kind of bullshit. I really don't like those sight lines. I need that Shiv to be alive, though. Because um, he's going to get a brilliant flank on someone, probably, at some point. Okay, overwatch my sniper. Alright, we're gonna start to move people up, I think. Uh, I'm debating where to bring this guy. It's not cover, actually, weirdly enough. My assault has the best moves, so... Uh, Gunnar can also move up somewhere. Well, actually, no, he can't. Yes, sir. You'll bring a bunch of people up. Time to motor. Moving to designated Sniper can still just steady weapon. Uh, Overwatch over here. I'm almost certain there's mutons in the cockpit. Oh, fuck. I thought that was cockpit. That guy's dead. I, I, I sprinted him there. I'm sorry, I'm going back a turn. I'm, I'm... Fuck it. Whatever. I apologize for safe scumming, but that was an error. I, the entire time, I, I've been looking at the, the, the views, and it's been basically telling me that there's guy, the closest enemy is in the cockpit, or the closest enemy is that thin man, and then, like, that's why I was so confident to make a, a large move like that, uh, but then it didn't happen. However, I'll go, what I'll do is I'll go here instead and potentially activate them. No, I won't. Okay. Uh, whatever. Fucking, go flame me in comments. I don't care. At this point, this 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 mod is really fucking hard. That's affirmative. Actually, at this point, it'd be nice to bring people up. Uh... Orders confirmed. On the move. Commander, you. All right. I shield, Commander. Uh, and the sniper's gonna go all the way over here, yes, and then sir. to that tree over there. I'm Overwatch. Roger. I said, usually I'm, I'm fairly confident in my moves like that, where I'm just like, oh, there's nobody else there, but uh, in that particular class, that didn't really happen. I said, the, the impression I'm beginning the entire time is like, oh, they're in the cockpit. <laughs> Whatever. You live, you learn, I guess. And people get mad at you. Uh, let's have a look. I mean, this entire thing is hard. This is why I didn't play this on Iron Man, so I could do this. I'll be honest. I don't even know why I need to defend myself. I mean, I, I am playing a run without fucking Iron Man on purpose, because this mod is very difficult. Alright. Here's a plan. Alright. Alright, so they're just kind of scattering around. No shots. You only have one shot, and it's on that guy. Apparently, you're supposed to do uh, the dam, the basically maximum damage to him. So, yeah, that's a kill. All right. 
Now, the question is where to go for this move. And the answer will be away. Ship is going to come down here. Uh, and we're also going to move my uh, infantry. Well, fuck. Are you kidding? Go there. I, I misclicked, basically. Um, we're going to go bring some I'm people into some different positions. Alright. He's got full cover. You should be fine. Now we know there was two packs there, obviously, because of the fact I loaded it. But, you know. I'm debating some better cover for some of these people, but I, I just can't get it, so. And for... I mean, I thought the Mutant was in the cockpit, to be honest. I haven't heard what sounds like outsiders at all. It looks like whoever's there is just still opening the, all the fucking doors. Oh, well, there's the Muton pack. That's one. Alright. Uh, it's one shot we can take, or another shot we can take. Neither neither of these really require me to crit anything. Um, we're gonna, I think, take the one where he's higher up, because that's a more far away shot. A gunner can have a chance, too. Yeah, there you go. Oh. Yeah, we'll take 44. We are unfortunately probably going to have to move up here. I feel, I feel, Commander. Nope, they can still see me. Uh, not what I wanted. So let's do, let's do this. Let's take two shots with a pistol. <laughs> okay. Salt's probably dead. Could have probably sprinted him all the way back. I, I regret that now just because I can I realize I can still actually see both of them. Alright, that muton is causing trouble. Uh, and here we now we get some overwatch shots. There we go, Shivy. Even if I keep him alive with just one health, I'm still good with that. Okay, he's just going back there and Okay. And he's behind there. And apparently... He can see him or no? Okay, he can see him. He's behind the tree, basically. Oh, now we can see them. Really random. Alright. Sniper stalls a shot. Unfortunately, Sniper's gonna have to reload next turn. But we've been picking him off. I think the extra clip size would come in handy for the, the, my sniper. I'm not gonna lie. Why would I lie? Alright, I think we are going to just move all the way the fuck back here with this guy. Because we've officially shoot and scoot uh, the hell out of this, so... I mean, the plan is to let that muton move up, and then uh, and then we'll get all our guns on him. It's a shame we don't have the sniper anymore. But the sniper got like like the sniper got a lot of kills, guys. The sniper did their job. We do have two Overwatch shots with him. We also have that rocket available. Come on, like seriously, <laughs> the aim this yeah, difficult. The oh, he still counts as in cover when he's moving, weirdly enough. Oh, there we go, we got him. Okay, that's nice to know. 
Oh, uh, the second Overwatch shot got that one. All right. Uh, yeah, you are definitely reloading. 58 and 44. Uh, we also have rockets. Uh, we're gonna definitely. We need to Overwatch with him. That's. There's no question about that. Um, well, reload and then Overwatch. We still have. We still have a lot of rockets, basically. Uh, so I'm not against basically just shooting this rocket at them. We don't need someone dying, so this is really awkward. Going hot. Oh, not not the best damage, but I don't know. Maybe I'll make them think twice about coming up here. Oh, you have a good chance to crit, actually. I'll do that. Ah, uh, fuck me. Uh, let's see. We do have this grenade, but I don't think we're going to have much use for that. We're just going to overwatch. Let him come after us. We, ha we, we have a double overwatch. Uh, okay, I didn't like the fact it went over here because I I don't know if we have sight up there. I, I just assumed we did. Come on. He's got, like, a lot of overwatch stuff. He gets two separate overwatches, though. There we go. Okay, we got that guy. No longer a threat. And we still got one more. Oh, really? Oh, the shiv. Oh, okay. Well, you know, I said it. The shiv is expendable. No regrets, fellas. Damn it. Mm, 60. No shot on the on that guy. Yeah, we can take two shots with the laser pistol. There we go. And okay. Oh, come on, you got that guy. There we go. Got him. Overwatch. I got my eyes on. As unfortunately that muton, so I'm gonna have to decide someone to move up with. Yeah, that doesn't sound very appealing, what I just heard. That sounds pretty horrible, actually. Is the mute on there? Yeah, so that's, um... I'm pretty sure it's a new enemy that we haven't seen yet. Okay, we're moving up with this guy. He's, uh, unfortunately now the point man. Welcome to the team. I, I, I didn't really want you to be point man, but uh, it, since the shiv is gone, uh, it's gonna have to be you. So we still we have, let's so let, let's let's do the math right now. We have um, unfortunately a muton that's running around, as well as uh, uh, one thin man. It doesn't look like he's changed positions though. We're gonna be real happy we brought along all these rockets, I'm gonna tell you that. It's not nice uh, g going into active enemies like this. Especially when they're not being- not playing by the rules and being aggressive. We saw- we saw somebody here. Okay, hunker. Uh, he's probably over here. Yeah, there he is. What are you? You're the Muton. Are you the only one who can get a shot on him? You could run and gun him. Alright. My hopes and dreams is that he's gonna kind of run after my guy here. Go all the way back. If he comes out, my sniper can hit him. Oh, 
Yeah, we know he's over there. We don't have a high enough angle to shoot him at. Not even my sniper could get him. The sniper could probably get him if she goes up to this place, but... Oh, uh, here we go. A floater? Really? That's... Okay. I, gu I guess we did miss a bunch of floaters. I mean, I wasn't keeping track of that. Alright, there's the floater. Alright, he's down there somewhere now. Did you hear something? Why do you not want to come after me, Muton Senpai? Activity. Ah, uh, I'm skeptical. I don't really want to go up there. Let's bring uh, this guy back here. Let's do some overwatching first. We're, we're hearing the music. I don't know why. Oh, there he is. Muton. We have a fair number of overwatches around, though. He's hopefully gonna trigger more than one of them. Oh, shit! Go fuck yourself. What? Kid! Why? Still, my sniper doesn't see him, weirdly enough. My sniper has a really high position, too. It's kind of weird. He's also kind of floating in the air. Alright, we got him. We were kind of switching around positions, and we did manage to get him, so it's all good. I'm finding it really random that my sniper doesn't get the weirdest of shots like that. It's like, you have the high ground, and the person with the low ground fucking beat you. Like, am I missing something about this place? I don't know. Alright, let's give it another turn here. Alright. They're forward. As far as I know. There's still that fucking thin man somewhere. Alright. Rocketeers are probably gonna just have to go up here. Moving. Reloaded. I feel commander that scan. I feel commander. All right, well, let's have a look. Oh, we see nothing here. I'm just gonna overwatch there. I know there's the thin man running around, but in this particular case, I have no choice. I don't want to. I don't want to dash him somewhere and then activate someone. I mean, the closest thing we can hear is over there. It doesn't. It certainly doesn't sound like a thin man. I'll tell you that much. Uh, oh, it's um. It's that guy. Uh, it's a cyber disc. We got our first cyber disc. Cool. Okay. Thank God, my person actually has some shots here. Now, unfortunately, we don't have a shot on the uh, cyber disc. Where's the seeker? Okay, these are just all the same guys. So, my gunner will take the first shot. Because I, I didn't know which one that is. And then pretty much I think I'm going to just run the fuck back down here. Although they, the Sector Pod could get a shot on him. Maybe run back down here. Uh, 
Um, yeah, let's get one with higher health here. Alright, so he's going to be a major problem, but uh, we fortunately do have a bit of buffer. So we're going to move these people okay. back. Um, to, like, make sure they have to move up as much as humanly possible. And then you're going to move pretty much just back down here. Uh, I'm, I'm worried about that positioning, but you know, if we go here, it's actually just as good. Because uh, they can't see they can't see him. And that's the goal. Although, they might be able to see him now. Nice. Hostiles pacified. I may I may be regretting that now. Um, well, no, I'm not, because it worked out. Okay. Right, remove here. Roger. I've got my eyes on. Moving to Overwatch. Now, so, now the fucking the cyber disk I'm a little bit worried about. That's probably the greatest threat here. Sentito. Sentito. I think what we might do is we might head to this elevator. Uh, sorry, this ladder. It's not, it's not an elevator. That way we can kind of give our, our teammates sight. Yeah, and by the way, we really only do have three shots with that sniper. I wasn't kidding. There's a lot of fucking enemies on this map. Ah, oh, we have a bunch of reaction shots here. Fucking hell, man. You just aim like tards. Is this his second reaction shot? Okay, here's a cyber disc. Alright. Oh, what? Wow. Just fucking nuked from orbit. Well, this is why we have a second Rocketeer. Question is, do we really want to put this rocket into him right now? We may not need to. Yeah, that's kind of bullshitty. Yeah, we're gonna put the rocket in him. Oops. Hi, mouse. Don't go crazy. Just right on, right on top of him. Suck on this. All right, sniper can definitely hit him. Uh, let's have a look. Um, yeah, it's pretty much. Well, let's see. Uh, they're go she's gonna bleed out. So this is the only st shot the sniper can take. Then the sniper has to go stabilize my other rocket here. I don't think anybody else has a med kit here. Oh, and they explode. That's right. It's good to know. Back in. I'm overwatch. Sniper has to move next turn, though. Because I, I kind of want to save the Rocketeer. Alright. You're going that back there. Everyone else is going to have to cover the sniper, unfortunately. This is why we brought just one med kit, just for a situation like this. And that last rocket is going to be saved for potentially another situation coming up. But I was hoping to have that last, that other rocket too, but, you know, whatever. Alright, you're good to go. Very cautious. I'm, I'm just being an Overwatch now. All right. Uh, well, let's go do some reloads. I'm, we may have missed one of the uh, little things, but that's okay because he hears something. I don't know what he hears. Oh, there he is. Oh, we, we can see him in the giant hole in the wall. Well, let's try and kill him with uh, two pistol shots. Oh, what? That killed him? Okay. 
So that takes care of that thin man. I don't think we have much else of, in terms of people uh, that uh, are kind of on the map and around. I think we just have now the cockpit to do. I'm just gonna listen for the next one. Yeah, I can guarantee that's what it is. So, let's go run around and get to the other side. Because we're not we're not breaching the from the front where the window when the where the doors are all busted in. In fact, that one looks like it's kind of yeah the same deal. Um, so we're gonna breach from all. We're gonna go all the way around the map. Well, we've established that they are definitely inside the cockpit, so we're about ready to go into position here. We're going to just uh, steady our aim with a couple people. Um, her down. Overwatch. It's, it's probably just the outsiders. So we have all the study weapons available to us. Uh, we even have that little UFO flight computer thing. I'm going to make a hard save here, just because um, I want the option of going back. Um, I don't care. I've already... At this point, I, I need this for this game, so let's go see what's inside. Pop her open. flight computer could prove to be extremely useful in our own research. Please take great care in returning it to the base in one piece. Yeah, thanks for, um, uh, by the way, close combat specialist. It really worked out. Fucking Christ. Alright. Rocketeer is going to blow a big ass hole in this wall here. She has really kick-ass aim. That rocket- those rockets don't actually do as much damage as I would have thought. Alright. Let's see. 100%. 85% chance to crit. Yeah, let's try it. Okay, a 9- a 9 critical. Alright. Gatling laser. Just against that guy, really? Well, I think it's because that, that person is in the way. Yeah, it's the same deal with both of them. So I think my shotgunner has to move up to potentially over here. And then we can get like a double shot on him. We have another one with a lot of health there, too. And that one has a lot of health as well. Alright. Good stuff. Uh, I don't know why we had a cutscene there, to be honest. 70%, 59. Yeah, let's take that one. Fucking, I don't need misses. I really don't. Just crit him. Hostiles pacified. 10% chance to crit. Oh, whatever. Overwatch. We got we got two Overwatch things with Sentinel, so this is why we do that. And you missed a point blank. You're gonna have to keep keeping score. Well, he missed that guy. There's that. There's that. Uh, the 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 problem might become when everyone starts panicking. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Fuck! Alright, and I think there's like one around here and he's gonna get a flank on my... this guy here. Oh, he's dead. Well, you know, it might be... it might be not in vain if we get this, guys. 
Oh, well, we can get the one in the back there. Laser rifle can hit him. Either of these are flanks. I mean, you have a good chance of hitting him, so I guess he might as well do it. Okay, he's probably gonna have to reload with his turn. All right, you only have two shots. You might as well take the one back there and try and crit him. I'm gonna actually potentially flashbang these guys. I have the flashbang. This is like the only time this is really gonna come in handy. Except you can't see him. You can't see both of them. Really randomly enough. I think you might just flashbang that guy then. Well, I need I need him I need him to be on Overwatch. He gets two shots that way. So this that was actually the, probably the worst person to give that fucking ability to. All right, try and get that guy. Come the fuck on. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Kill him, thank you. There we go. Cause then we get to use the two shots. And then that guy we're just gonna flank the shit out of. He really wants my sniper. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Yeah, okay, well, sort of did. All right. Who has a grenade? Um, what, what, what's a, what the fuck did you just do? We do have a grenade. We can totally bring him out of his cover. Well, lie, I'm kind of up for that. I'm rolling. It's go time. Because we'll kill that guy too. Now, I think that's a UFO flight computer, like, right here. So if we kind of position it like this, I think I think it'll be intact. I don't know if that what that is, but maybe that's the core or something. I don't know what the fuck it is. Okay. Hey, what kind of shot do you have? You'd have to... Okay, I hope, I hope you can shoot him here. No, you can't. That's a problem. Actually, we still have the flashbang. Let's use it. Okay, you can just tunker. Yeah, there's no way you're getting him. That probably means this turn we got this guy. 50%, maybe not. Well, let's just take some shots. Oh, okay, no, we got him. He's definitely ours. Moving out. Take the flank shot. Oh, come on. Uh, okay, well, we're gonna do a, 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 a heater shot now. This is kind of why we have this. 100% chance to hit. Everything by the numbers. We got it, guys. At the at the expense of our assault, and our rocketeer got downed. We got 40 aliens <laughs> out of that entire fucking mission. Um, it's a shame about our assault, but we'll level another one. We got a ton of resources out of it, so that kind of that worked out. I think that's I think that's worth it. Let's see what we got, guys. All right. One promotion? Really? <laughs> fucking hell. This fucking mod. Alright, we got uh, a new... Uh, let's see here, we got... Um, so, we got Shredder Rocket here, we got Will to Survive, confers one or two bonus damage reduction if in cover and not flanked. Ready for anything, if we if we fire without moving, we'll automatically enter Overwatch. So this is what I mean about Overwatch um, Rocketeer, which is kind of neat. Uh, or we can get uh, rocket launchers and primary weapons do additional damage. I think we're going to go for additional damage. Oh, here we go. This is what I wanted. All right. So, I noticed this on the wiki for this game, and I and I, and I wanted to do this. So, basically, the reason why I'm making an Overwatch one is I can do Overwatch here, maybe, like, heat ammo for this one, 
so you can overwatch with heat ammo. And then with this one, I guess, uh, Executioner or something, even though he doesn't really... I haven't really used Danger Zone with this guy at all, actually. It's kind of been kind of awful. I, I, I just don't suppress that often, I suppose. But anyways, uh, so we get an option between Ready for Anything, which is uh, if we fire without moving, it automatically enters Overwatch at the end of the turn. Apparently, what one of the things you get after this is you can get Sentinel, which means you get two shots per Overwatch, which means with a gunner, you can potentially get three shots in one turn. Really nice if you do Overwatch. We didn't do Overwatch with this guy, so this is not very useful. Rapid Fire. This is, um... Uh, well, there's Rapid Fire and there's Double Tap, and you're asking... I asked myself this before, like, what the hell's the point in this? Why is there both? And I'll tell you this, I'll tell you this. It's because, um... I have an LMG, you... I'm not moving and shooting, basically. Um, so this Double Tap will allow me to take one turn, every other turn, to fire twice. Um, I can't do, uh, I can't do suppression, I'm pretty sure, I, I don't know, I, I, yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure I can't do suppression with that, but I can fire twice, which is, with a really powerful weapon, really, really good. Um, rapid fire, on the other hand, is meant for if you run the saw. Uh, the saw is the one that allows you to move and shoot. So the idea is you're supposed to move into position and then rapid fire them. So you get basically, it's the same thing as this, essentially, you get a double shot with an aim penalty, but you get to move beforehand, so... Rapid fire, absolutely useless for me, but double tap, very, very good. That's definitely something we're taking. And that's it. Uh, we lost Pat and we lost uh, Halo Den. Sorry about that, Halo Den. But we got 20 Flutter Corpses, 2 Thin Men Corpses, Mutant Corpse, 2 Berserker Corpses, Cyber Dusk Wreck, Drone Rex, 118 Illyrium, 105 Alloys, 34 Rapid Weapon Fragments, 11 Melt, 6 Stasis Tanks, 2 UFO Flight Computers, 2 Alien Surgery, and some damage shit, and who cares? Okay, that is f way fucking worth it. I was complaining the entire I fucking time. I difficulty understanding how such an advanced species could show so little empathy for the lives of other sentient beings. It goes against everything we have ever imagined. The technology is there, but with it comes a callousness we would never have expected. What could have brought them to this? Okay, we're gonna actually finish up advanced body armor because I want to get started on some body armor stuff really soon. Uh, we got that fission generator coming down. Laboratory is coming down. I guess we're not actually going to change anything right now, believe it or not. Although I really should build um, at least one laser cannon. Just one. Because that's going to be for our... Uh, this is going to be for our fighters better weapon. Oh, we have a uh, 30 engineers? Yeah. Oh, we're good for that. Alright, uh, guess keep spinning the globe. Uh, cause we're, we're gonna spend those resources real soon, trust me. And Exalt's being an asshole. They basically recognize I have all this money. Um, I used to bring, I used to bring Halid in for these missions. I, I don't care about the Exalt, fuck that. Alright. And 12 Valerian for two engineers? No. We're gonna keep that now. Even though we have so much of it. Commander, we're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. We're so close to advanced body armor. But we've got a moderate mission here. Who do we actually have on the roster here? Oh, we actually we actually do have a fair number of good people here. Um, I'm gonna start leveling, uh, I think our Biggie Smalls, the, the assault is gonna... Biggie Talls, sorry. Uh, I think Biggie Talls is gonna come along just because I need an assault replacement. Uh, for the one we lost, uh, but for the resources that we got from that, it was worth it. And we're actually probably going to look into maybe um, hiring some more rookies soon, because uh, we, like you are noticing, we are losing people still. Um, I'm doing better than my first run, but we're still losing people. Uh, it happens. Uh, it's, for that mission that we did, we did before, I think I think it was well worth it though to get the resources. It was a bit of a suicide thing with that uh, guy, but I needed to do that that double shot with. Um, my uh, my salt there, uh, so you know I'm I'm I, overall I'm happy with the way that went, and so um, I mean the scout we still have a lot of gravely wounded people too. This is one of the other problems we have is when people get like really wounded they're down for a month. See that sniper our good sniper we had in the last mission 19 days just gone, um, but that was a really difficult mission. So and like l l this one lights out railgun uh, was one of the people down to 37 days more than a month they're gone so that's why we need to also level some more people up this is why like as i said if you're in the names file you have a big opportunity to be in this in this game with me or maybe you're already dead maybe you'll come back who knows <laughs> so i hope you guys are enjoying and uh remember we will always be watching take care